Welcome back. We're going to play some games against Beginner Bot, this time with yet another twist, just to make things exciting. So, we'll see what it is in just a moment. Uh, playing the Void Challenge rule so I don't accidentally play invalid words. 30 minutes per player hopefully is enough. We'll find out. Uh, North American sounds like a good language to me, or lexicon. So here we go. Now, I claim that this is... Yeah, it's fake blindfold mode. It really is. And it's because, like, honestly, I maybe someday I could transition to real blindfold mode, but for now, I'm quite satisfied with this. In the same way that I'm satisfied with my, like, fake 100% speedrun category. Um where I don't do the pyramid thing where I go all the way back down. If I lose a game and that kind of thing, I just say, you know what, we're just going to keep going and keep rematching until I beat the bot. Similarly here, I recognize that my board vision is just myopic, so we're going to play with the board visible, but only be able to see the last play. And... We're not even going to see all of the last play, we're just going to see the tiles that were added in the last play. So this is fake blindfold mode, with my own little Woogles conceal script I've uploaded to GitHub. So yeah, I'm able to see the first play, but from here on out, it's just going to get harder and harder. Oh, I meant to put on triple challenge rather than void. My mistake. Um, yeah, we're going to change the stream title. It's false advertising, so it's going to be Void Challenge instead of Triple. And, you know, maybe if I win one, then we'll switch to Triple Challenge mode. Um, uh, I put on Triple Challenge last time I tried this because uh, I was just so not optimistic about my chances, and I wanted some ability to concede the game as quickly as possible. But I seem to have lost that possibility here. I mean, I could resign, but it feels bad. So, what am I going to do with these tiles? J-I-I-B, and then we got a U and a V. Oh man, this is like where I would normally exchange. But that, well, no, we could play this here. So Realm and Vibe. And we still have J-U-I-S, fine, whatever. And so now there's Vaney. Realm and Vibe and Vaney. And like I said, my board vision is going to... It needs work. Maybe someday if I could ever get the hang of this, maybe I could try the other blindfold mode. But this is just already super intense. So... Um, and of course, just to make things fun, we have a U and a W. Well, <laughs> what to do? Um, I could spell win. We still have the J and the U. Uh, uh. It would help if I knew the words, too. <laughs> oh, no. So, I want to play, like, Jury, but there's... Okay, no, that doesn't work at all. Oh, D-G... D-J-I-N, or even J-I-N, are both words. I'm still stuck with the W and the U, though. I need to play one of these, U or W, as soon as possible. Um... Eventually, they'll get around to adding uwu to CSW. And it'll be a tremendous victory for everybody. Not that I even have that here, but it's just one more thing that'll make the game more interesting. Uh, seeing emoticons appear on a board. That'll be a new one for everybody. Um, yeah, I don't know. My initial thought of win is okay, but just like the leave. Oh my goodness. I don't like it. Uh, 
realm. Um, yeah, I think a win getting one of these difficult to play tiles out might not be bad. Uh, realm. Faint, no. I played something. Vibe. Yeah, so I could always play something across here. I don't know if you see this. Okay. So I played Win. There's Realm, Vibe, Veiny, Win, Crow. Um. Uh. See, if this were triple challenge, I could just play something that's not a word and end the madness. Um, hmm. So I could play like Mush, which is terrible. Um, hmm. Realm. Vibe. So could I play across Vibe? Could I play like... I don't have Jin. I don't have any cool words here. And the C it clamps the board. Um... Baney wins. There's a Y here. Uh... And we're playing North American Lexicon, so I can't play CH. Uh, so, Realm. Mush is, as much as I don't like it, like, I'm not going to find anything better. Wait, Lush is a word. L U S H. Score something. <laughs> I can't see the score. Oh no, what have I done? Well, it's okay. I can still see the total after I play. So now it plays Quoth. And the Q is not on a bonus square, so like I'm doing okay somehow. Oh my goodness. Um. This is horrible. Yes, you're you're right. The downside of this is that the viewers get the full experience that I'm getting, which that's my like one regret about this is that I don't have a way to cast this. Uh, I don't know what to do to try to like give myself this experience, but allow folks to see the whole board. I wish there were some easy way to do it. There probably is, I just haven't thought of it. Um, like, if I had another browser up that were following the game somehow, then I cast that browser's board somewhere in here. Folks would be able to see that. Or I could, like, cast it in this big white space here, or move my board into this space, and then, like, show the full board over here. I could set up some overlay. Um, it's doable. And then every time another... Well, actually rematches a follow through because the website has rematches. It lacks a player TV, so every time... The first time I do a game, I'd have to like set this up, but... <sighs> oh my god. So... This, uh, uh, I don't know. This is horrible. <laughs> uh, so wait, this is Realm? This is Lush. I could play Joy over here to burn some high-scoring tiles. Oh, I see. Because I can see the first tile, the score is shown above the first tile, but... 
If I were to place something where the first tile is hidden, I don't get the score either. I see. That's interesting. Maybe I should fix that to hide the score always. Probably I should fix that. Um, so I want to play something across to this queue. Uh, what could I even have here? So now we have like the DJI for Jin. I don't remember there being an open N anywhere. Honestly, Realm, Lush, uh, something I forgot in the top half of the board. <laughs> this is not good. Um, wait, can I do this here? So this is like the one advantage of this mode is I can forget the top half of the board and still maybe get to play things, but I don't think UD is valid. Yeah, so... This could work. Uh... Wait. Is this valid in North American Lexicon? I don't think so. No. This probably, I think... Oh no. Really? Okay. Huh. Okay. I mean, Joy is not the worst. Um. This is okay, I suppose. Trying to score something bigger on some future turn. Tilt is right. Um, so, wait, Q, uh, whatever this was, wait, I played Kadi from this, which was Q, U, O, something, because I was thinking of playing Joy here. Um, I've got four vowels, but I don't know. This is probably fine. Wait, what? How... Whatever was played up here... Um, I previously played something to the double? I don't understand. It must... this must be a parallel play? I'm guessing? Um... I'm gonna try. Oh, wait. Is this valid? It is. Okay. I think this messes with the person's mind. The actual looking at the board is now starting to have me question everything. So, T I L T. Um. Yeah, this might be a bad idea. Um, I don't know.
All right, so there's a sea floating out in space somewhere here. I played Grizz. This Z out here, I guess, is still open. Um, hello, welcome. Um, so, how about this? That's not a word. Oh, Z-O-L's a word. Just not in the English lexicon. I guess that's why this remains open. It's not easy to begin a word with a Z. Um, Alright, so... I want to play... Wait, F-E is not a word, is it? Fe is a word. Uh, so what to play across here, I wonder. What makes sense? Oh, felt is something, the first thing that occurred to me, but the leave is horrific. But I don't see anything better. Okay. Realm. Something, that must be an I for picks. Oh, this is painful. Um... Belt. So I could play Om here. Uh, or Am. Okay, so Bald. Fair point. Um. Oh. Oh, wait. The play contained illegal words. I have to, like, fix that to not show the illegal word to me. Now that reminds me that Lush had been previously played down to this double. Um. Yeah, I'm still suffering a lot, but, um. Wait. Punt? Isn't punto, like, Spanish, but also acceptable in English. It is. F. So I'd previously played Chris, and now it played if. And I have zero understanding of this position. Uh, realm? Lush. Realm. Vibus would have been played up here. There's been picks. Picks. Vibe. Something. Uh. Wait, can I play zero here? Oh, if. I see. Yeah, even with that clue, like, don't know what to do. I have no understanding of the board at this point. Uh, how can I possibly continue? Realm. Uh, I mean, we could try to see, like, is over realm a word? No. 
Uh, there's picks that showed up here with the X on the triple. Um, not that this is valid, but yeah, over picks, no. The only thing I can do is pass here to ask for more information. Oh, right. That's right. I could exchange. Exchanging is probably better than passing. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the exchange tiles dialog hides all the tiles. <laughs> okay, we're just going to exchange all. Uh. <laughs> oh, that was funny. Uh, if Grizz D. D something. So there's a D in space. Um, uh, tunages? I don't know. Oh, it's something ED. Rather, it doesn't end in S, ends in D. Something ED. What can I make this? I don't know, man. Iguanas. Iguanad. I don't know. Something playing the U is really what I should be doing here. Unaged. Um. Yeah, I don't know how else to play the U here. It's just like my one chance to like come to win the game, to gain a lead. But I have just no idea what to play. Un something ed. Unsnagged? I don't know. That has... oh, GC. Wait, there's a C down here? That doesn't help. So, Pix was played here. Could I... First play was Realm. I don't know if XUL is... oh. Okay. I'm learning a lot of stuff about the board through these error dialogues but also not anywhere near enough to try to reconstruct realm, lush, vibe, very, uh, something, see something. Yeah, I just have to pass. Wait, what? How is this a thing? Um. All right, can I put? Okay, wait. I can't put my cursor on this square, so there must be a tile there. Um. Okay, I can't build down from here out. Yeah, no, I'm just completely at a loss again. O A. All right. Do I know anything ending in O? Just 
uno. Invalid word. Um, What could it be? A go seems playable. I. All right. Yeah, I don't know what to make of that. I'll pass. I'm still confused. Slave. All right. E something. Let's play whatever. Wait, I don't know even. Um. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, this is a terrible use of a blank. It doesn't even use the U. That's the real problem. I need to play my U somehow. Um, nouns. All right, this is terrible. Sneer. Oh, we're out of tiles. Thank God, the game will end. Uh... Alright, we only lose by 67 points. So, yeah, that was challenging. Shall we take a look at the board? Yeah, let's take a look. This is what the board actually looked like. Um, oh. Cadi area. So I don't remember when area got played. Probably it got played during this frenzy of me um, passing repeatedly. Yeah, I just missed that this got played. But, um... What could I have played here, I wonder? Neurons? Oh, there was a A hook here for from a go. I thought the C blocked this, but also I failed to find this. Uh, did not know this word. A long-tailed monkey. Gwenon. Non-uses, non-user. Oh wait, non-users? Through the open R. Noiston. Aggregate of small aquatic aquatic organisms. Chose. Oh. Yeah, simply putting an S here was good. Then there was my play, which was atrocious, but um it's okay. Wait, I didn't even play that here. Um, so I missed sleeves here, among other stuff. Uh, I missed... Wait, no, the bot had these possibilities. Yeah, I still had all my same bingos and such, but I played nouns. And... Beginner bot to its credit did not play Renin's to close, but instead played Sneer. And I lost track of the tile count, but it didn't matter at this point. Uh, horse is pretty clever. Ethos is nice. Echoes. I didn't know SH was acceptable in North American lexicon. Evidently it is. So yeah, that's 
me losing to beginner bot. Um, how much did we lose by? Yeah, I salvaged a little bit of my dignity at the end, but uh, yep. Yeah. So I don't really feel like trying a rematch. Sometimes I do, but I don't think this match went that well. So I think perhaps we call this particular match there. Um, that said, we could try playing a rematch with the bot, this time without blindfold mode. So, we'll see whether or not I know any words at all, but, um, all right, maybe this will be easier. So we have the IER. We had... Just one more letter, we'd have like mightier. Um, I don't actually know what to do in this kind of weird situation. There's probably some less obvious bingo here somehow. Uh, don't know. Suppose we play Grim and move on. Or maybe we play Rim and hope to do a G hook on Rim. But there's other hooks on Rim too, so Grim is not terrible. Um Wait, ING. So, M E R T I N G. I don't know. I'm not uh -huh. seeing it. Hey, look, we got both blanks now. So, we just need to find something that hits the M. <laughs> um, I S M. No, don't think so. How about here? Man, I mean, another possibility is if there were a hook on card, there were a front hook, just play something across there. Um, I feel some obligation to play an eight, but I'm not that great. So we have like secreted or something, but not really. Um, I keep shuffling this in the hope of finding a word. There's got to be a word. Credits. Miss credit would be a nine. Yeah, I don't really have an IS. If I had an ISM suffix here, the remaining letters would be D E C T. So it's unlikely. I keep cycling back through that in my mind, but I'm not thinking of D C E T. Um, not seeing cadetism or something. It'd have to be something like that, but, uh, yeah. Likewise, ISM would be like Miss Cadet or something. Uh, or you could have an ED suffix. How would an ED suffix miscatted? Uh, is taped. <laughs> uh, yeah, I didn't think that would be so easy to find. So, we have credits. We should play credits somewhere if it does play. 
it plays with the S here. Plays with an S not there. Um, there's probably other bingos, but let's just play one. Wait, Grimm's... Oh. Uh-oh. Uh, my justification for delving so deeply into that was that, well, at least we have credits. We don't. Oh, no. I should have looked for more easy possibilities. Oh, that's a shame. Now I just look dumb. I mean... More so than usual, but I see now that I have one vowel. So my ambition was unwarranted. Um, I don't know. Darkest. Yeah, that's how you spell darkest, for sure. Um, all right, well, we, I want to play the C somewhere. Because it's kind of hard to play. But it doesn't jive well with any of the other stuff. <sighs> that's sad. All right, now we have five consonants and nowhere to play anything. Um, hmm. That's so sad. I mean, we could play like jacks with playing both blanks. That would not be smart. And drop a T here and see what the bot comes up with. All right, we have a vowel again. It's not the best one, but we'll take it. Um, hmm. Yeah, I just am not finding a good spot for the C or the J. And I'm just not easily contented with stuff here. That requires a G, though, doesn't it? Yeah. Um. Alright, so we've played off our best tiles, other than the blanks. Um. Wait. We could continue closing, but no. Op is not in this book. All right. Um, I mean, this is playable. All right, so now we got no vowels again, and that's fine. We've got picks. Picks is fine. Uh, we got square. if we wanted it. Probably should have played the Q right there if I had had my wits about me. Probably should have played off the Q. That would have been the smart thing to do. Um... Hmm... 
And we could play this, right? Nope. Jaw is not in the book. All right. Um. Hmm. All right, here we surely we have a bingo with like squeals. So let's not muck it up. Uh, this looks like the right place to put it. Yeah. Uh, shift S. No. Yeah, no, I think this is right. Because you get doubled and triple the double there. Um, I think this is the right way to play it. Oh. All right. I was afraid of that. Um... I mean, this is okay. Unless we are playing like equals or equates or something. Um, this is a lot of points and a good leave. We can't be dissatisfied with it. Um, but we're still ahead too. Yeah, I don't know what to do with this. I mean, Olive suggests itself. Uh, we have duplicated ease, overly. If we have overly somewhere, like maybe here, it's risky, but. Um, This is less risky, I think, than sticking an O in the triple-triple column. Here, we don't get triple-tripled in the worst case. Is there another place to stick such a thing? Not that I see. Looking, looking, no. It looks like that's it. Um, beginner bot mercifully plays another extension for some reason. And now we could just play like Faws or maybe in What's. I don't know if there's some other fancy thing that combines the F, W, and H. Like whiffs, but we don't really have that. But yeah, this scores a lot, blocks a lot, and somehow, yeah, we seem to be doing okay. Huh. So what now? So I looked at the chat, I see I missed Crest earlier. Uh, I suppose I did. Um, so I want to hit the corner. It'd be nice if we had keg or something. Um, I don't... Oh, this would have to be an F, then. Uh, F, L, something. Doesn't really look playable. Uh, 
Yeah, so I guess that's the reason the bot hasn't taken a corner either, is because it's not super easy to reach. Um, something to put an E here could be reasonable, but it'd have to end in an E unless, like, like, Kero is something for frog, right? No. I don't know. This game's hard, man. It's fun, but man, it's hard. Grimer is not more than a Pokemon. I did wonder about that. Um, hmm. Well, to win the game, we do need to complete it somehow. And that apparently requires playing valid words, or passing, or exchanging. And somehow I'm too proud to exchange at this one moment. But exchanging might not be a bad idea. Like, EE -E is only an international book, right? It's not an American. Yeah. Um. Oh, C-I-S-T. Like, you could potentially put some fun things on the front of that. A lot of fun things to go on the front of C-I-S-T. Um. I suppose this works. So we kind of have to fish for that now, just for fun. Just any C-I-S-T front hook. Um... Well, we got the predictable one first, didn't we? Um, yeah, I guess we have to... Well, we could score some points down here before playing racist. Um, so, how do we score the points? I want to play the U. I don't suppose either of these words are valid. Nope. I don't have anything that plays under the R. So yeah, I guess we just take the spot. Uh, it's a pity I don't have something that scores better. Maybe I do. It scores the same and leaves me with letters that aren't totally terrible. So let's do that. Uh... Got another U. That's cool. I can't complain too much. At least I shouldn't. Would have been nice to hit... Wait. I had flu in the corner and instead I played flower. Because I'm an idiot. Um... Hmm. Okay, muff requires two Fs. Um, I suppose Guff also does, yeah. 
So what do we do with another U? M-A-U-L is just kind of dumb. I don't think all is playable. No. Also, if it were playable, I don't think I would have regretted it. But it's not playable. Um, I could stick an M here, right? Oh, we can't. All right, how about this? I guess it's fine. Hmm. How about GIF? GIF is playable. All right. It plays a zap. Not for, well, it gets 20 points for the Z. That's decently clever. We've got another U that we play. So we got our U played. We've drawn the final U just for fun. Uh, actually, we've got two U's. Wow. Well, what do we play with two U's? That's just a company. <laughs> uh, well, we've just, this is not a great rack. <laughs> Thankfully, it doesn't matter. We've drawn all the U's this game, so every other game we play, we're just never going to get a U. Because that's how probability works. Ah... <laughs> uh. Why? Why did this... I mean, I kind of deserved it, but still, why? That's so funny. I just have to, like, pass or play out. So... Ulu, the ultimate lookup utility, I think is actually based on some real word. I don't know. I'll have to find out what it means. Oh. Hey, look, we still have... tiles. We could bingo if we hit the right tiles, but it's not happening. I could spell Udon. Um, but I better just be stick the H here for a 9 and see what the bot comes up with, I think. No, the bot's going to want to take this corner. I could play this for 6. Um... Hmm. Over lied. I don't suppose is valid. No. Um. I'll just block the corner there. Bot takes fourteen points. Wow, I still can't think of words. I've got video here, but like, where would it go? Isn't this a word? No. Nah. That would've been too cool. Can't be real. Um, still got video. Still can't find a place to play video. I don't see where EAN goes. I don't see the bot opening up the board to let me play video to go out. So I should try to find places to put letters somehow. Um. I'm a genius. Alright. Well, we survived this game somehow against Beginner Bot. That went much better than the blindfold game that preceded it. But, um, 
yeah, it's expected that if you play at a reasonable pace, you should have a good chance against beginner bot. And evidently, I have a good chance against beginner bot. Um, I mean, we could take a look at the game, see just how many things I missed. Uh, wait, I missed ragtime, terming, migrate, metring. What is metring? I guess unless we play it, we don't get to see the definition, but I can't hear the analyzer, so. Grim it is. Um, misacted, muscadet, miscited. Damn. This is a strong thing. A strong hook. Jets. Yeah, I just could not figure anything out there. Dejects. So that's not a bingo, is it? Oh, grimed. Uh, subject. Okay. Yeah, I'm just not playing well. Um. Okay, so the bot mist and train and other fun things. Jinxes. Would have been fine. So I played this to play off the P and the X. And here, despite... Well, I got one vowel, so there's only so much that can be done. Sequela. I had no idea. Calcs. Again, no idea. Quelas. No idea. Plaques. That should have been findable. Not easy, but squeals, I think is what I did. Or tried to do. Oh. Yeah, and then... Okay. Right. I confused myself. Alright, we don't need to look at the rest of the game. It's because, like, I'm just missing so many things here. Um, but yeah, somehow I managed to prevail by drawing, like, most of the S's and both blanks and all the power tiles. Um, so somehow I managed to prevail. I did draw a few U's, which I thought was kind of funny, but... Overall, um, my draw was actually quite excellent. I guess I didn't get the Z, but, you know, um, still a good draw. And yeah, we managed to defeat this by a more solid margin than in my previous video, if I remember right. So, hooray for that. Um, yeah, hope we enjoyed these games.